Hello, YouTube, and welcome back in. No, I have not gone crazy. We do have a victor as our first governor. Who would have guessed that? Probably nobody. And indeed, I think I'll just take monumentality. A little bit of culture is fine. Um, but I think I like where we're at here. Allows me to take a little bit of advantage of the faith that we're getting. Now we can go meet Japan. I wonder where this is going. There he be. I need to help out. We need our scouts' military strength here. Might be able to war him through here, depending on what the terrain looks like, actually. If I can actually get through these mountains, that, that that's actually pretty sweet, then. I need to be able to send him a trade route pretty soon, but... Alright. So now... And finish this because this will be done next turn. This will be done next turn. No hour of life is. He likes me. Wow. Um. So what does the continent divide look like? Pretty interesting. Well distributed. We have all three continents already. And then we go ahead and do this. We'll get housing, production, and then that very, very valuable promotion. So six turns on that. We'll continue to save our money. <laughs> Play this as an order of it, of silliness of their hat. That's That's a great idea. Um, so I can't reach him at all. And I can't reach this, so I guess we might as well take Suzerain here. That'll give us a bunch of extra vision. Oh, no, Suzerain of Auckland. Okay, I'll take that. It's pretty far away. I'm a little worried about barbs killing my trade route. This would be safer. An enormous and lofty column of flame allowed the people in Holt cool. to read as perfectly at night as if it had been day. All the way up here. All the volcano wonders. And then, yeah, we get a good amount of uh, information and intel from that suzerain. Just knowing that coast is here. Um, helps me prioritize what we're going to be doing. Hey, Sarge, how you doing, dude? Okay, um... Got back from your annual trip. Where'd you go? If I can ask. We're having fun. Uh, this is this is pretty pretty cool so far. Um, we should probably denounce fairly soon. We're done with this in five. But I'll chill just a second. There we go. And then off to explore more.
Hey, he actually settled pretty much where I would have wanted him to. There's a campus harbor. Not bad. And it's going to loyalty flip to us. I like it. Oh, that's awesome, Sarge. So much, so much D&D. &D. <laughs> Let's go after... What are we going after now? I, I think I want currency before iron working. We should be able to get started with just our uh with with just that. I want to be able to get more uh commercial hubs, more trade routes, things like that. Yeah, the Keshig, it's been a while. So actually the last time I played Mongolia, the uh it was before the encampment buildings were fixed, and so my units didn't keep that extra movement and stuff. Um so that's kind of wild. We were actually able to get to political philosophy at uh, turn 56 with all of our first meets and things, and that's with teching military and mysticism, which is rather impressive, if I do say so myself. I'm going to put it in maneuver now, keep our production going. Seems good. It's willing to give me four gold per turn for open borders. I will take it. Seven turns. If only this city, you know, had housing available to it, maybe they could have kept this. I, uh, I, I, I'm doing balanced in this game, Sarge, because I also never get iron and things. So we'll start with defense logistics, and we want to get to Embrasure before we really start spamming out um, units and stuff. I need a governor title. So I could start the government plaza here. <laughs> nice, Blurk. Yeah, we should roll over Arabia, even without those promotions and things. Um, the trick is going to be Japan. I'm just gonna uh, I'm gonna build Splore here for a second. Nice, we can get through it, and that became an amazing campus. So we do find we do get a, a, a just a terrific campus here. Two, four, six. This would have been five, which is fine, but that's nice. Um, and then yeah, I want I want to be able to send him a trade route here soon. So let's do that. Um. Actually, not ready to be doing anything with this. There's also no reason not to at the moment. So I guess I should build this. The city will have plenty of growth, so it's a fine spot for our government plaza. I just don't really know where we're building it. Do I buy like this tile? That way this city can get in on it too. Possibly like a wonder theater square. One, two, three. So if I build a city here, campuses we've got covered. It could honestly just go on this wheat tile. That's kind of where I want it. 
I have to get to irrigation. Or no, one turn on pottery. Um, Yeah, thank you. Almost turn 50. I think this is the better spot. Yeah, it doesn't do anything for the encampment. It's true. But the encampment could build a wonder here. Like terracotta and then like theater square for these guys or something. Yeah, lots of opportunities for flood damage. No doubt about that. We can get a dam in there. Actually, ooh, yeah, that's not great. Because the dam doesn't get boosted by the government plaza either. I still think it's fine. I still think that's what we're doing. Yeah, I'll plan it out. So... Be government. This be our capital's commercial hub. Although they need a harbor, they don't even need a commercial hub in there. I mean, this is just, it's all it's gonna all be commercial hubs, is really it. I don't even really need to plan it. Like, it's gonna be this. I think I will get their commercial hub. How's the how's the cap gonna grow? <laughs> so this city can get that. I could honestly build it here. <gasps> That's kinda cute has two dead tiles, but it boosts the faith gen, and then we could get more out of monumentality. Uh, I'm not doing that, but I don't hate the idea. All right, something like that is where we're going to wind up. Yeah, lots of flood damage. Maybe, maybe, maybe one of these is a dam. This could be a dam, right? Oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Yeah, could be industrial for because of all these cities. We'll see. Point being, that's where I'm putting the government plaza. That's all we had to figure out. No man ever wetted. Thank you, Thalia. I will go ahead and save. Yeah, I would do the encampment or the dam here. And then the industrial zone there. I have not listened to the hardcore uh, history podcast. On the other side. Down here. You can't damn not a floodplains is the problem. So unless there's another floodplains on here somewhere, it doesn't work. So the dam will will have to go there somewhere, but it's fine. Okay, um gosh, I could almost build the industrial zone or the uh government plaza here as well. Because I could get another city down there. It's not too bad. Yeah, this is fine. All 
All right, so we'll have our next uh, promotion on Victor in five. That'll time out pretty well with political philosophy. We'll be able to start the building right away. Um, yeah, seems decent. Decent. He doesn't like fresh water either. A lot of gold. I'm going to take it. We'll fight him eventually, but it's going to be fine. Nice. He has more strategic. So our Pantheon's not that bad for where we're at. What is this? I mean, can't. Wait. Entertainment? Why? That's the one district you're not supposed to build is Japan. <laughs> no aqueduct here? At all? Oh, no. We can technically. Wow, turn 51 pyramids. That's crazy. Writing means sharing. It's part of the human. I think I have to do that. We need to be able to get through here, though. There we go. Then we can do it. So get your obvious districts when you can. I'm going to go ahead and say that this plus six campus is a priority. So that's pretty good. Uh, and then we can start our units, although three turns. How fast do you build them? I'm going to get you a granary real quick, and then I'll start units. Yeah. Because then I'll have the promotions when we're done, and I need to give them a little bit more housing. They need a builder, too, actually. It's 80 for it. Thanks, Johnny. Yeah, I, I, I definitely need to check that out. I've been... Uh, I don't know if I... This is this is almost like a confessional for me, uh, what I'm about to say. I've, I've been so... Um, so the Harmon Town podcast, uh, if anyone's listened to that or knows Dan Harmon um, or knows my love of community and, and everything that Dan creates. I've listened to the, the, the Harmon Town podcast um, for the, the last, I don't know, six years or something like that. Uh, and, it's, and it's had like a really significant impact on my life. Um, helped me get through a relationship a while back. Uh, just has a lot of a lot of meaning to me. No, 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 no. And, uh, and it's recently ended. And that makes me really, really sad because I love it so much, right? Um, but I haven't been I haven't been able to bring myself to listen to the final episode because <laughs> I'm like, I know I'm just gonna cry. like I know it's just gonna be the saddest uh, that it's over. And so I've been re-listening to Harmontown again, uh, which is not really productive, but I, I'm, I'm happy. <laughs> Harmontown, yeah, exactly. Build an encampment here. We could build one there. Harmontown is a podcast from Dan Harmon. Dan Harmon wrote Community, Rick and Morty. Um, I don't know, other stuff too. But so I'm, I'm a little embarrassed to say I haven't. I, like, I'm seriously like, it's sitting in my Stitcher and it's like, do you want to listen to me? And I'm like, no. No, I can't. I'm not ready. I have to brace for it. But it's an excellent, it's an excellent podcast. Uh, he has, he and I have a lot of the same like upbringing, uh, being from the Midwest and whatnot, and then also just philosophy. So we go oligarchy here. Want to keep maneuver in? We also want great generals. Keep production in there as well, and we'll go influence points. 
All right. We are pretty well set up for all this. So this is done. So now all of our horses will start with an extra promotion. He stabilized over here, by the way. All right, I will go Warlord's Throne here. We should be able to b produce all of our uh, horses there, I think. We could also buy their unit. I think I'm going to denounce now. I'm going to get a bunch of holy sites, huh? Yeah, we still need to build a bit of an army. I think it'll telegraph our move too much. Nice canal cap. What a boss. Brussels. Hey, Brussels. Brussels, I forget what you do. Oh, wonders. All right, now we can grow a bit. I do want that heavy chariot eventually. Nice tiles. Ojo got the Apadana. Nice. That means we get the Apadana. What a cool continent. We're going to get a lot of holy sites. Wealth consists not in having great possessions. All right, I might be able to send a horse up there to deal with it. Can I post the C for this one? Yes. Uh, if I if I forget, just remind me. Hey, Muffin. Yeah, all the religions are founded. <laughs> Indeed, Powell. Indeed. Um, apprenticeship, I think, makes the most sense. We'll just go right there. Uh, 12 turns will make our minds better. Produce things. Could use a few more builders. <laughs> Thanks, Robert. Thanks, Blake. <laughs> Do I want to buy a builder? It's one ninety five for a settler. If I buy the builder, what can it do? I could tech the crabs. That would give me a full housing here, as opposed to just the half I'm dealing with, allowing us to get up to eight pop, which is pretty decent. Um, we could definitely use a... Actually, we should we should get the builder here, because we can improve this, this. And that, maybe. I don't have the tech for this yet. I don't have the tech for the coffee. <laughs> All right, so we start with our horsemen, and they have a promotion. 
Um, oh, they clear. Oh no, they didn't clear it already. Do I think I can sneak up there in time? I kind of do. While we build more. Yeah, they stabilized the city that was flipping. Love that. Five movement. Pretty cool. All my Diplo favor is going to go away. I'm going to keep our money rolling. The AI does love building siege units. I'm going to alternate a little bit there. Just doesn't have the money for it. Eh, I'm going to keep them. It's tempting. We'll get that soon. We might be warring Hojo very quickly, depending on how quickly Arabia falls. So I don't want to friend him. Here's Nubia. It's your favorite soup? Oh, man, I love soup. Yeah, a few archers early on can help you deal with barbs pretty effectively. Way over there. I like a good gumbo. Six turns on the throne. Okay, I think I'm ready. Are we ready to denounce? We're only going to have about four horses immediately, anyways. Just a little bit longer here. He might be at crossbows, like, already. We've got our general. All right, I guess we're ready to go. Guess we are ready to go. So money, production, seems good. Oh, you know what we need? I need that chariot. I 
please help me? I want that. N yeah, this this is reflective of anything they get with um with their bonuses. Um, I could sell her iron. She's pretty far away. I'm okay with that. Sweet. Get that and then that. I'm ready. I could do this now, but I'll just get the chariot. Doesn't matter quite yet. Could have been friends, it's true. Ooh, hello, religious city state. Ooh. French Eleanor. Wee oui, wee. Oui. That'll be fun later. So Coupe might Coupe might wind up being last on our list. <laughs> Only five arrow score away from a golden here. So there's my suzerain. more horses. All right, I am so ready. Three turns, okay. Wow. Now that's a city-state for us, with all of our uh, volcanoes and volcano wonders. Pretty interesting. If it's natural to kill... first <laughs> yeah sorry thud is that everybody that should yeah that's everybody all 
All right, so apprenticeship and then up to stirrups. That is where our Keshig is. So this is a, requires horses. It is a ranged unit that requires horses. Three maintenance, so pretty expensive. Uh, not really in comparison to the knights. Knights are four. Uh, but 30 melee strength, 40 range strength, but can escort units. So um, actually, it, weirdly enough, we may wind up using its ability just to escort some settlers and settle some cities as we're going. Uh, and yeah, we're, we're going to wind up going well over era score. I'm pretty aware of that. Pretty aware, unfortunately. Uh, okay. So, two turns we declare. Turn 69 DOW. Nice. I could run this real quick. The faith wouldn't be bad from Jerusalem either. My man. I prefer the science and culture though. Just leave it that way. Gurgai, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Is there a quicker policy change? I think I used them all up already. She got the Jeb. Yeah, he got walls. We've telegraphed ourselves a little too much now. Next turn, we're good. So one thing we're actually going to do a lot of um, is pillage all these holy sites so that we can actually faith buy some settlers and things. Don't think there's anything else on Victor that we want. I don't think I need Garrison Commander. Hey, Sammy. Is it really worth it to wait for a formal world domination games? No, probably not. Yeah, it definitely telegraphs your movement and gives them time to prepare. That's okay. Pingala? Or do I go for a Magnus so that I can get some settlers out? I think I go Pingala here. A little nervous about him having crossbows. I'm saving money for knights. Go back here. <laughs> I don't mind aqueducts. I don't think they're a reason to build industrial zones. Is the difference between me and others. But I, I like aqueduct cities. They're fine. <laughs> Highlight feature silly. Yeah, it, it throws me. Because I because I, I feel like I do a pretty good job responding to most of you guys. Although I guess it's different. It gets harder when you have like 250 people watching to, to respond to every little thing. Yeah, so indeed... Uh, we get we have a 36 base strength horseman. horseman. Uh, we get the plus three for the trading post that we sent the trade route to immediately, and that gets doubled. Uh, and then plus three for Mongol horde. So we have 45 strength horsemen, uh, which is pretty darn good. Even our war chariots are decent. Got walls, though. Two 
260. I missed 10 lurkers. No. My bad. My bad. Thud. Thank you so much for the repeat sub. Welcome back into the shop. Thank you for the prime, my friend. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Go yes. get him at the game mechanic. Don't forget the general. Good call. I will. I will, Thud. Thank you very much. Uh, the ram doesn't work with horses at the moment. Um, so we're going to need... some swordsmen which is fine they'll be strong swordsmen I'll get those eventually we've got plenty of iron for it have they fixed the exploit for the pantheon yet you refuse to play until they do you, you know you don't have to use it right walls here now M yeah multiplayer is a I, I i i can i can appreciate that the multiplayer thing it's getting walls everywhere probably shouldn't have denounced i think the reason he has walls is because uh we denounced i guess i should have done the uh stone rather than this I'd like to pillage a little bit more. Should be fixed by now. Just don't use it, man. I think that's silly. I think that's silly logic. Drew, thank you so much for the tier three, dude. Welcome back. Thank you for the 10 months. I appreciate you very, very much. Thank you for that support. Okay, thank you. Okay, so this one we keep. little bit four turns I can start one of those so I can either keep going with some heavy chariots um, or start thinking about tucking iron working <laughs> saying it's silly logic is not mean it's silly logic why why would you deprive yourself of something that's fun based on like a weird principle I, I don't I'm not trying to be mean I just think it's silly We're a ways we're a ways away from feudalism. I think we have to tech this rather than go for that. Like I've never used it, it's never bothered me one bit. Again, the multiplayer side of it I do see. If you're a multiplayer and, and that's a problem. I mean don't play with those people that are exploiting things, but A couple more, I think. Barding. You know... Really? What? This bothers me way more than the Pantheon exploit. Why won't she trade with me? Why why why, why won't you give me a full horse worth? <laughs> so, let's see. I can pay 600 750 for 10 or I'll pay 60 for 10.
worth the 750 gold to not have to click through this. <laughs> Thought prices were supposed to go down in bulk. Yeah, yeah. I, this isn't my fault. I I need I need resources. That that whatever algorithms de determining that is is silly. Um, yeah, that 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 bothers me more than most other things. Like you should be able to trade with your with your uh, opponents. And they shouldn't be charging you 750 gold for 20 for 10 horses. That's silly. So the only other city I can snag real quick is this. Um I want to capture this if I can. I'm going to keep saving my money. I may wind up buying like a... Uh, Battering ram. And I'd rather just hard produce the swordsman here. My man. Shadow Broker, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Good to have you here. Swords. Oh, we didn't get the, uh, we just kept, aw. Well, all right, I guess. I don't have battering ram tech. I'll get that in a minute. I want to get a quick commercial hub. While I wait for more strategics. Either that or I have to buy some more right now. I guess that's fine. Although this is super irritating. I need nine more. Horses in Baghdad? No. Horses down here in Damascus. In Cairo, once we get there, but we're a little ways away. Oh, come on! Getting walls. Yeah, next time we don't we don't uh, we don't denounce. I think. I'm gonna lock that in, and then we'll get nine more. All the way around. A 
This is your this is your Civ APM. This is this is how you tell if you're really good at the game or not. How fast can you do this? Oh, three more. Zoomed. What's up, buddy? How are you? How's your life today? I was I was teasing the thing that we were talking about last night to to chat earlier. Oh, doesn't want to give me that one. Thank you. All right, another horse here. That's her favorite horse, yeah, it must have been. Press escape instead of clicking goodbye. Okay. Gotta work on my Civ APM. Yeah, that's awesome, man. I, I seriously, as soon as possible, like whenever you want to, just let me know. I would I'm down. Get yourself going for the day. Nice, dude. Very nice. We're getting ourselves going too. Speaking of where we're going, we're uh we're we're out of here. We're out of time. Uh, if you're watching over on YouTube, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Don't forget to stop by twitch.tv slash the game mechanic. Come see us play out these wars and things in person on the internet. It's way more fun in person. I promise. See you then.